he had that look in his eye that he, 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 you know, he had the will to win. Proud dad. This dude's gonna have a game. Special. That's the word that comes to mind when describing Sean Foster. My 16 years of coaching, you know, he's probably the best athlete that I've had an opportunity to coach. But the thing that really makes Sean special is he's a better young man than he even is a football player. The do-it-all Wildcat quarterback carried Grand Lynch. His dad, a former MSU player, watching from the sideline. The smile says it all. I see me. I mean, it's just, it's just the, the instincts and, and the, the determination, the cutback, the acceleration. I, I, I see me. Three touchdowns in the first half. I know he's going to have a good game every game because he's Sean Foster, you know? It's like, he's a special kid. Another three trips to the end zone, he's at six. Just over a minute left in a tied game, the ball in Sean's hands. Then I, I seen the opening once I spun out of one, and I was like, you got to take it all the way. You got to. It was like a blur. Um, I saw it, and then once I knew he was gone, I, I put my head on my lap, you know, and I just, I cried. And then it was kind of like, a, you know, a, a shock. He was still up. You know, how was he still on his feet? And he kind of broke out of the pile, and then I knew that nobody was going to catch him from behind. Seven touchdowns, 396 yards. Grand Ledge beats DeWitt for the first time since 2016. All on senior night. A lot of them I was zoned out on, but that last one stood out because how loud the crowd was. I, that's like the only time I've ever noticed the noise of the crowd when I was running. With a proud dad watching from afar. This is a, a smile of watching your son succeed and, and accomplishing his dreams and, and having fun doing it. And a kid with the determination to win. Reporting in Grand Ledge, Thomas Cook, Fox 47 Sports.